Well, what is specifically high in Slovakia is the youth unemployment rate. Unfortunately, Slovakia is one of the few countries where the youth unemployment rate is more than one third of the age group under uh, 25 years. And this is a very severe uh, problem. It shows a disconnection between the, between the education system and the training system on the one hand and the labor market on the other hand. And that's why a key measure should be to improve the performance and the capacity of the education and training systems, which provide the foundation uh, for uh, the entry uh, to the labor market of uh, the youth. It needs um, uh, probably a further development and change of the substance of uh, what is being taught, perhaps more entrepreneurship, more ICT, more foreign languages. Uh, it's all uh, very important in a modern integrated uh, European economy. Um, but it's also important that uh, uh, the, uh, the way the labor market is organized uh, is developed further. It may require the introduction of new types of contracts. Well, we advocate, for example, in case uh, the labor market is too much segmented and uh, excludes a certain group, especially the youth, to introduce the so-called open-ended uh, contract, which helps the young people to build up their rights uh, uh, gradually, and they will not need to interrupt their employment relation with an employer uh, if they want to move forward towards a more uh, permanent job after they started somewhere. So there are a variety of measures, since the problem is large, it's not one type of solution, it's not one policy which will help, but several uh, uh, policies. It's also embedded in the overall economic policy of the country to find the right uh, development model. But I believe that this conference which we had uh, today, the exchange of experience within the Visegrad group, will help uh, the government finding good solutions.